Hey guys, welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews. Thanks for joining me once again and for continuing to support the channel as well as all the developers that provide us with the coupons and promos for these watch faces. Now in today's show, I want to introduce you guys to a new developer that's just come out with a number of really nicely designed watch faces and I have a feeling that we're going to see some really great styles from this developer in the future. So I'm excited to show you just a few in his collection today. And as usual, I'll be selecting eight winners in our coupon giveaway contest and if you're chosen as one of them, then you're going to get to pick any one of the faces that I review today. So make sure you go participate for a chance to win. Okay, for now though, let's go check out these faces from this new developer of the show called AY Watch Faces. Okay, kicking things off, here's a classy analog watch face that has a mix of dials. There's a gauge there on the right hand side which shows the current date, as well as some color theme customizations and a really nice textured background. Now for color themes, you can change the colors of the hour and the minute hands both independently of each other so you can create some really nice contrasting accents against that darker background. And for those three dials on the face, you have your step count and distance moved to the top, your battery remaining is to the left, and your last recorded heart rate and calories burnt are shown in the bottom dial. This one also comes preloaded with three fixed app shortcuts to your S health, your settings, and schedule apps. Alright, next up is an all digital watch face and this one has both a sporty and a modern design to it and I really like the layout here because you have different colored and textured panels, there's different backgrounds as well as those different colored icons and I think this helps give it a rugged appearance as well. And for color customizations on this model, you can change the colors of those two display panels, again both independent of each other, and with the top panel there displays your date and we count, and the bottom panel includes a digital time, which can also be set in a 12 or 24 hour format. You then have a battery status dial on the left hand side, a day indicator to the right, and then a multitude of app launchers with a total of six fixed and one customizable. And finally, this one also supports both the English and German languages for the date displayed. Okay, and the last one I want to show you is actually available in either a hybrid or digital model. And I'm going to show you both here because other than removing the analog time in that one variation, the rest of the features and the functionality between the two models is actually identical. And as you can see, I'm starting here with the hybrid version. Now double tapping on the center of the face enables you to cycle through a number of nice textured backgrounds, as well as one theme that changes the, the middle ribbon there to a multi-toned color purple, which really adds a nice contrast to the face. And you can see the date is also shown there right in the middle of that band. Now other features for this one include your heart rate, your step count and goal, and distance traveled above, and then your floors climbed, your battery remaining, and weak count is shown there in the bottom half. And as I mentioned before, the digital version carries the same functionality, but remember this is a separate download, so pick the style that you like best. And if you want more information on the watch faces that I review today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of these faces, and I've also included the direct links to all of them in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away coupon codes to random viewers that comment here, as well as coupons to random registered users on the watch face community website, mygalaxywatch.com. So you have two chances to win both here and on the website, but remember that you have to be a registered user in order to participate, so make sure you go sign up. As always, good luck to everyone, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks again for watching our review, and if you liked it, then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends, because with your support, it helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and of course, fresh content. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care.